35 now on daybreak and if, if your new year's resolution is to shed some pounds well this next story might give you the motivation to put one foot or paw in front of the other get it done right <laughs> it's a story about a dog who lost nearly half of her body weight and daybreak stephanie barnes is here now to introduce us to honey good yeah. morning steph melissa good morning good morning everyone honey is a beagle who has lost more nearly 40 pounds and counting, but this is not just an inspiring story about weight loss. It's a story about a second chance at life for this dog, and it's about the love of some key people and organizations that have helped her along the way. This is Honey the Beagle last year. <laughs> Honey was brought to the SBCA of Niagara County in June as a euthanasia request. Weighing in at 68 pounds, more than twice the weight of a healthy beagle, she was obese and immobile. Her nails were significantly overgrown. She was urinating and defecating on herself, so there were some urine burns on her belly. Honey's owner was an elderly woman with dementia. The SBCA suspects she would forget she fed Honey and feed her again. Plus, Honey had unchecked thyroid issues. Luckily, though, this is not the end of Honey's story. The SBCA, a no-kill shelter, committed to saving her. They regulated her hypothyroidism with meds and got to work on the pounds. Come on. A couple months in, and Honey was down more than 20 pounds. She was transferred to Sue's home, a volunteer dog foster, where she worked out even more, playing in the yard, taking walks, and spending twice a week at Pinewood Rehab, doing things like this water treadmill. I was amazed at how fast it happened. Um, and I gotta say, it was mostly her. Once she was in a home and able to move around and that, she just went. And she keeps going. When I met Honey this week, you could see it not only in her mobility, but her mood. Not just her agility, but her attitude. She's lost weight, but she's gained life again. A new dog, both outside and in. Now, the SPCA says they would like to see Honey lose about five more pounds before she is medically cleared and ready for adoption. I will warn you, though, her foster mom there, Sue, that you just met, definitely wants to adopt her after oh, bonding so dibs, closely huh? through the experience. Yeah, and you can follow along with Honey's uh, story through the Niagara SPCA Facebook page. No surprise here, she has created quite a following. Oh, there. yeah, I can see how she's got a following. I mean, Honey seems like such a great dog, but you also got to give it up for the Niagara County SPCA, which had a history so many years ago of nearly closing because of issues. And now to take on a project like this and just have another success story like we've seen in recent years, it's just wonderful. Absolutely. Inspiring for the dog, for other dogs, for us, even in mm -hmm. our health as well. So yeah. <laughs> great story stuff. Thanks.